Your daily out with Oh, hey, oh, yeah, look at that. It's the tower. I wonder if we're going to come up there. Oh, uh, there it is, yeah. Oh, hey. the car at the top of the screen. That was a pretty cool view. We're going to run this up a little bit. Oh, it's a gun! It's a gun right there! Yeah. And Luke! And Luke. Man, who's this way? Are we? Oh, okay. Luke, your hot lap is in the blanket the there in the background a little bit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the yeah, place is spiritual. spiritual. <laughs> yeah, There's no spiritual hat. Does it have ghosts in it? <laughs> Somebody in San Francisco stopped me and said, You look very spiritual in that hat. You're imbued with the spirit of grandfather or something? <laughs> yeah. I said, You know, I'm not a very spiritual person at all. Mm -hmm. He says, No, 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 I can tell you're spiritual. <laughs> Based on your hat. He starts to me about my spirituality. He says, You right. are. And I say, I'm not. And because you wear a fight about hat, whether or not I'm spiritual. Like you're, um, <laughs> <laughs> Some kind of guru, I guess. You can pick it, but yeah, pick it with your hat. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, I got this like big coat. I've got out in, uh, uh, out in spiritual insights you've never heard before. Come on, follow me. Yeah, I keep yeah. Yeah. the cats. The, I, I ran the cats up. I'm the shepherd of the cats. Yeah. And I preach to the... Yeah, all the strays. <laughs> <laughs> there is some gullible people out there. Yeah. <laughs> I want my share. Give me some gullible people. I know all, that. <laughs> all the secrets of the cats. Yeah. Just give me some money and so uh, uh, here is you throw, you throw them out the secrets. window and see how they uh, land and watch the patterns and interpret the patterns of oh. where they land and, and say, you know, comforting things to them. <laughs> The cats say you will grow to a hundred years old and be very happy and earn lots of money and have a great career and a wonderful spouse. I think you can have like a spiritual <laughs> massage, you like lay them down and then you just <laughs> pile <laughs> cats on top of them and they just float. <laughs> if you're being imbued with the power of the cats. <laughs> the, the, cat powers, the sacred cat powers. power. <laughs> sacred palm massage. You use right. it by cat power, yeah. How many guys on the show? Uh, yeah. It's like a, a two weeks ago. Do we do this once a month? It's been monthly. Did you see any uh, anything interesting in the last month? Yeah. No, everything I see is boring. Yeah. <laughs> I, I look at the walls in my see apartment room. You haven't seen any details in your wall? No. <laughs> no, I haven't done hallucinogenics. <laughs> I haven't had the privilege of seeing weird things in the walls. <laughs> Uh, you know I don't do drugs, uh, not so. That's true. Uh, Maybe you don't know. Oh, I found a case of PBR I'd forgotten about. Half a case. <laughs> where, where was it? It was uh, down by the rice. For the cupboard? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't have room for it out anywhere else, and I had a party at some point, and like months and months ago. And I just kind of stashed it down there. And, uh, last night I was like, oh, I'm going to make some rice. I put the drawer on the side. Hey, yeah. Is that good? Is it a good guess of time? <laughs> I guess so, yeah, I don't know. I mean, it was PPR. <laughs> <laughs> it's not necessarily the... It was like four or five cans of it or something. Oh, yeah. Weak alcohol. Yeah. 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 But, it, hey, it's, it's like... like oh, go ahead. I got a message from the military. Okay, okay Lewis. Uh, I need the program. Let's see it. No, I have not. Is that, oh, he was on that the one time when we went to the... Hello? Uh, uh, Lewis. He was on the PCP thing, wasn't he? Yes. Oh, yeah. how's, how's it going? Now I'm on TCP. PC trial. He's speaking through a spring tube. Is that how you're on Luca here? What's going to happen? It's definitely a loop. 
Well, you brought the whole TCTV to the yeah, studio. Yeah, it's uh, running around somewhere. There's two of them, yeah. Oh, wow. I don't know what you're talking about. I think it's really, really hard. Are you pretty good? Who am I speaking to? That's my name, Luke. My hair. Okay. Say something here. And me. What? It's me and that's my name, Luke. Kenny, I can't really hear you. Uh, mm -hmm. How now? Yeah, and I can hear you. Okay, hey, uh, so, I'm not doing anything tomorrow, we can do the show at any time. Any time? Yes. Okay, um, uh, how about noon? Alright, kind of early, you wanna, how about, at, like, see What about one? Right, one. That's a good compromise. Uh, what yeah, okay. Uh, are you okay, Liz? You don't think you're tired or something? Um, I don't know. I had done this on the weird schedule. Uh, are you, are you that, outside? That something. Yeah. No, it's part of the wind. Where are, uh, how's the weather? Are you getting rained on? No, it's not raining anymore. Oh. Although I, I tried to go to the food bank with Mark, and then we got there, and we're like, oh, it's Veterans Day. Yeah. Government things aren't open, and there's no mail either. Oh, Veterans Day, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We're both all 11-11-11. Oh, yeah, I think that's the magic, right? <laughs> Yeah, well, you know, people say when it's 11 11 you make a wish, but now it's like really, it's like, it's like 11 11 11 11. Yeah, so how many wishes can you make? Uh, in infinite, I think. I hope you got a photo. I don't, yeah. You can't tell if you have any wishes. If somebody said there's a photo, a photo is opening today because it's the crazy day that we delivered there, but. Oh, wait, are you. Are you sure they weren't talking about that video game that's coming out? Oh, is that what it is? Well, yeah, there's this, like, there's this video game oh. that's coming out today. I thought they were talking about a real portal. Oh, okay. I mean, they could be, like, they could have been talking about a real portal, I don't know. Was, was it like a nerd or like a hippie? No, it could be a nerd. It's probably just a... Uh, it's Okay, I'll see you Yeah, there's a uh, wind, it's windy. That's what it's doing outside, windy. Yeah, I tried to take my umbrella away. Look at the window here, there's a window over here. And clouds are going whoosh! They're booking from clouds. Going pretty fast. Yeah. That's all the messages. How come McDonald's never calls us? I didn't realize he yeah, has a holiday. Yeah, it's a holiday. Uh, Veterans Day, yet, yeah, so, uh... Glad I didn't try to go. Try to well, go? Uh, th thanks yeah. to the, you guys out there and uh, the, the veterans for fighting World War II and things, so... Uh, and Vietnam and stuff. And the new one. Thanks, guys, out there, the... The, <laughs> the army. <laughs> thanks, army, uh... Or I know better than this Military folks. It's also, yeah. it's also Canadian Remembrance Day. Oh, is it? So, mm -hmm. this is the day, but this was last week that we did things a week uh, So, we're, it's not only the, it, we can talk about it, but it's not the special. The Veterans Day special was last week. Oh, okay. Yeah. But, uh, it's also the last quarter. I don't know what that means on the calendar. Do you know what that means? Last quarter. Or of some uh, moon cycle or something? I don't know. Oh, yeah. yeah, it's something, something with the moon mm. is going to happen if you guys are out there uh, on the on the 18th, if you're watching this on TV, if you look at the moon, it's doing a thing. The moon will be stand its last quarter. It's going to be out on the corner moon. Okay, anybody got any change? Oh, that's how I, that's who it was in the studio yesterday when you called me. There was Angie. <laughs> Angie, it was Angie. I don't know how to spell it. <laughs> that's well, I like the way that's that sounds. Angie. Angie. Yeah. I didn't say it because you spelled it that way. I just um. 
I would have probably said it if you said it that way, even if you didn't spell it that way. Oh, okay. Because I'm a fan of pronouncing things wrong. That's what I do. That sounds pretty fun. Wrong. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, and it's not all funny to produce And see how, see how he's doing today and see how the production man is going. Sure, I'll call him the producer. Hey, producer. Yeah! Woo! Yeah, I'm gonna call, call it funny. Look at this. a dance or dance? Is that this is the one? Or the. It's gonna happen again, too. Uh, it keeps hey, happening. Hey, how are you doing? Hey, buddy, we're doing good. How are you doing? Good, I'm at TCTV right now. Oh, yeah. At that front desk. Oh, yeah. yeah. We're going to be on TCTV, too. Oh, yeah, you're going to be on TCTV. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, I guess if, if somebody's watching this right now, we're on TCTV right now. Or, like, sure, is that record here? Yeah, hey. Hey, 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 hey. welcome back to the program. <laughs> Freddie, you are the producer. Um, oh, look, you should turn the mic up. Uh, hey, guys. Yeah, well, I guess. How about now? There's, there's nothing wrong with my mic. Uh, is that better, Freddie? Yeah, that sounds better. Oh, yeah. good. Well, uh, how's, that, how's it about TCTV? What's happening there? The coaches are in the street, they're shooting a little video with people uh, talking about um, justice thing. Uh, uh, justice? Bob Bowles is here, he's dead here, they're just kind of hanging out. Did you say Bob Bowles was there? <laughs> Bob Giles. Oh, Bob Giles, okay. Well, um, Bob I get them confused all the time, too. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's the uh, uh did we miss the garage, the garage show this week, right? Uh, last week for the viewers, but it's coming up, we didn't miss it, right? Yeah, yeah, it's tomorrow. It's tomorrow? Yeah. Did, you, did you get a look at what's, what, what they're having? Um, I couldn't take a look at some of the stuff that's in V. You should. We had to get a look at the AT&T people, because they had their AT&T Comcast. I don't know. There's some of the gear that we thought we were going to do, so we couldn't really do that, okay? You know, there's some video and audio patch channel, uh, rack mountable stuff here, um, a video router, um, we got some VCRs, some DVD players, some kind of weird thing here that uh, has a big camera attached to it, and like a little light table on the bottom and some lights on the side. I don't know what this thing is. Te it's a television camera. I think it's, I don't know. I don't know what this thing is. It's pretty, it looks pretty intense. Um, and then just kind of like random odds and ends. I saw a... We were looking for a chroma key machine, right? Yes. Um, I saw one around here, but I wonder if it might, it might have belonged to the other... Um, to AT&T. See, some of this stuff is ours to sell, and some of it was, I guess, on loan from... Uh, AT&T or something, and now AT Comcast owns that, owns them. Um, one thing that might interest you, I found this color video camera here. It looks pretty, pretty promising, but it's got like a weird input on the back. Like it, it, it's just like a plug with that looks like power and uh, everything else. And uh, I think it plugs right into the switcher. Like you know, there's, there's that one weird uh, external camera input on the on the big switcher. Oh yeah, we got it. Maybe it's got uh, it's got ten pins here. I'm not sure if it's the same one, but um, it, it might be worth getting. It looks like it because it's you know it doesn't have a tape tapeless camera. Just goes straight to the camera board. Yeah, I'll take a look. Yeah, we'll have to remember to check that out. Well, how's the how's the production end going in the in the show here? It's going good. I'm going to need to get the tapes from you. We're captured through to Tuesday, but that's the last tape that I've got, so um, maybe we'll figure out a way to get some tapes uh, to me today, and then everything will be good. All right. Yeah. Well, I'm probably... Bob, you need to... I might have to go here. Yeah, okay. Thanks, buddy. We'll talk to you later. Help the bomb. Bye-bye. 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 Thanks for it. Um, 
Yeah, so we're, we're not going to allow them to dance again. We're going to do that. Yeah, that's it. Um, People dancing. I wasn't uh, the music producer at that time. It was Justin. Just, just, just be the clown. Just be the clown. Justin be right. Who made the, the uh, music the set? The dance, oh dance, dance, holy dance, you know. We got it back. Came yeah, back up. there was a well-attended episode, but in my opinion, poorly lit. Yeah, it was a little dark. Can't see. It was dark? <laughs> they they were turning the lights? <laughs> Justin had this artistic um, thing up his butt. He wanted to uh, experiment with darkness and occasional spots of light on the dance floor. And so you see the dancers pass through these spots of light, and the rest of the time you can't see them. And Gyrating dark <laughs> shapes. <and laughs> Gyrating dark shapes. That sounds fun. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you know, I just realized what we did earlier on uh, Sunday. We went to the Gravity Appreciation Day. Yep. We threw pumpkins off a bridge. Oh, what bridge is that? It's up in Mason County, the High Steel Bridge. It's like a 400 foot high canyon bridge up on like, logging roads up there, so, <coughs> yeah, the, uh, again, there's a bunch of pumpkins, a bunch of people throwing pumpkins off the bridge. There's a video document of it up online at, uh, 10minuteshow.com, and, uh, there's a little video of the Gravity Appreciation Day thing there. Also, audio version that aired on my radio show last night. The audio version of throwing pumpkins off a bridge? You can yeah. still hear well, the pumpkins. Can, they're, they're really loud when they hit, because they go all the way down. There's like the canyon, the water, and the rocks, and just, you know. Yeah, that's fun. It's like can, cannonballs. Did you guys uh, draw on those pumpkins, or are they just regular pumpkins? Yeah, just regular pumpkins. There's a lot of them, though. I think they're all like uh, the ones that like Top Foods or something was getting rid of. The old ones. Yeah, uh, you so know. plus pumpkins. One of them was leaking out of the bottom a little bit. Oh, wow. A little drippy pumpkin. <laughs> you know, pumpkin, pumpkin plants growing down there? Uh, you throw all the, uh, I don't know. It's the sixth, it's the sixth annual Gravity Appreciation Day. A lot so of pumpkins, yeah. It's been a lot of pumpkins thrown down. I think this was a, a record-breaking year for pumpkins. There How was, many? I don't know. I don't know what the count was. Thirty? <laughs> no more than that, probably. Uh, it was like maybe part, six and then some people brought some more. People brought some jack-o'-lanterns too. Yes. This is a little tiny pumpkin, little little bitty, <laughs> little bitty, 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 bitty <laughs> pumpkin. Yeah, there was one not this size, you know, a little decorative okay. this size pumpkin. And then there was this one. Yeah, ten ten minute show dot com. So David Waters site for the little, little segment that he does there and uh, there's a video version and an audio version. Ten, 10 minutes of pumpkin drawing? Actually, <laughs> yeah, I think this, this that one went about 12 minutes. Wow. Uh, roughly 10 minute show. That's a lot of pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's like the precursor to it where he's interviewing people about gravity. Oh. And what gravity means to them. And there's a song too. Some music. What was that band? The band? Green on Red. Green on Red. Right. Was yeah. the band that played at the pumpkin? No, you just <laughs> no. <laughs> you got a band. Green on Red playing on the bridge? No. You were a band that had <laughs> the pumpkin and they played as the pumpkin draw. Green on Red playing that band, that, that song of theirs called Gravity Talks. Yeah. It was a fam uh, famous band? No, famous from the 80s. Uh, I guess. If you're an 80s kind of person. Too famous, I mean, too famous to get on the bridge. Yeah. From <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like the bridge. From his cousin. I <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, 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 McDonald's is. Probably McDonald's and Buffer. Washington, Buffer, Washington, is that? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Are you okay? That's where I'm from, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. There is a bu- there is a bu- I never really go there. Yeah. But Hear your hometown. <laughs> I don't really go to the one in, yeah, I, I don't really. I go up to the basic and I go back there and my mom's usually cooking stuff or something, I don't know. Well, then you eat your dog when you're in the back. It's Veterans Day, but all the McDonald's in Utah are closed. Is that everybody in McDonald's? Oh. Pressure break.
The secret door to McDonald's is open <laughs> then to you. <laughs> no. Free apple pies. I didn't, know, I didn't know McDonald's was so secure, you know. We had an entry code for something, so I tried to call it and then look. Uh, that was a good one because the, the commercial was about a phone. Oh, yeah. So we can yeah, have yeah, a phone. phone was yeah. And it didn't last time we were calling McDonald's, it was during a commercial? Or, yeah. Yeah, yeah that could have happened. Yeah. We need more commercials. You guys need commercials out there. Send us a commercial. Oh. Commercial. Because make one for the for the Timber uh, Lounge radio Timber, show. Timber, Timber. We've had the same commercial out there for the month. Uh, Should make one for Dance Only Dance or something. Yeah, we will. We'll put them on here. You guys make yeah, you guys can make the commercial. I think that's the other. I don't see TCP as well. Yeah, get the TCP shows. Where are the TCP shows are on now? I don't have a PCTV. Karaoke only. Oh yeah, there's that one. Uh, and then there's what, what other shows? Are there, are there any other religious shows like? Oh, is this a religious show? show? His show. His show. That's a funny show. I mean, show. Oh. His show. That's a really I don't I know. I tried to call her one time. I got, uh, she, cause she gives out her phone number at the end of the... Oh, you know what? I think I even went to talk to her and invite her into the show. And it never happened for some reason, but... Uh, she gives out her phone number at the end of the show. Mm-hmm. show and I tried to call her and invite her into the show, but she never showed up. Uh, what show is that? Was it it's, it's called His Show with, like, Diane something. His I Show. I forgot it. Really. His Show with Jesus. Oh, the Jesus. But it's His, 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 his Jesus' Show. Yeah. So, but, um, you get Jesus on the show. Yeah, like Don't come in and do the dance. Well, I think if we get this lady, she's pretty much the person we're going to get to Jesus. Uh, but she seems to know a lot about Jesus. Uh, from, oh, yeah. from the show, from the TV show. But she can come on the show maybe. And there's also him there. But uh, John Horseman, you know John Horseman? Yeah, yeah. He, his show might like, get taken off the air or something. I heard they got like, kicked out of the piece of news for a while. What kind of show is this? He had the show called Mental Health Solutions where he would... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I've seen that. I back when I had the cables. Yeah. I like that show. That show is kind of an influence on me. I, I don't know what the problem was that made him... I heard he was slandering people. That's what... And he was giving out people addresses. He was saying that, people, that like, his neighbors were doing bad things or something. And, his, and then... He gave out their addresses. Man. And then one time, a couple of months, maybe about a month ago or two months ago, I was talking about this and somebody called the show here. And I said, John Horseman said that his, uh, his neighbors hit him in the face and that they were mean or something. Or, 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 but, but then uh, somebody was watching the show and they called in and told me that John Horseman was giving out their addresses on TV. Hmm. So yeah. his show trying to get a said, vendetta yeah. to, to get a, a posse. Want to be part of John Horseman's posse and <laughs> jeez. Alright. This show was good though. And uh, it might get taken off the air or something. I don't I'm not really sure about that. Mm-hmm. People were complaining because he was t- saying specific addresses. You can't get out people's addresses. Yeah. Yeah. But you might be able to. I mean it just really depends. I think really, this is what I always say about getting football on T C T V I think is Somebody has to complain about it out there, so yeah, if, like there's been the thought and they're complaining about it, but if nobody's complaining about it, then people see it, whatever. Yeah. Hmm. Now we have uh, 35 minutes, we called to our last guest, we called some McDonald's, we checked all the messages, we called Freddy, that's pretty much all the stuff we have to do for the show. And now we have about 35 minutes of using our wits. <laughs> oh <Yeah>. no! <laughs> Didn't there, wasn't there two counters last time? I left my wits at home. There was, I, I retired this week I was making the crazy noises. Oh, okay. And that's just sitting there, I shouldn't get rid of it, but... <laughs> oh, that's why there's a smaller VCR on top of it, taking its place. Yeah. Doing its job. 
That's like a yeah. Jeff, what Jeff, Jeff Foxworthy <laughs> says in TV. Yeah. When you have two TVs and they're going to stack on each other. Yeah. That's, a, that's bad or something. Like, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's fun. So what are we going to do for 35 minutes now? You need to have a Belfair uh, Belfair McDonald's? A Belfair, okay. Belfair Washington. There's one up on the hill there. From what are we By the By the auto parts store. Well, don't call the other McDonald's. Don't call the McDonald's. Ask them if they have auto parts. <laughs> Belfair, Washington. There it is. We're gonna look at this place. All right, there we go. Where's Belfair? It's by Redmond in Seattle. No, or? no, totally opposite side. It's out in the woods. It's north of Shelton. Oh. Yeah, I'm out from the woods. So. But uh, yeah, no, there's a. Uh, it's, it's, it's like, you know where Bremerton is? Where have been to Bremerton before? I don't, I don't, I don't know. It's like across from... It's like... So it's basically like the opposite side of the water. Do they have Seattle McDonald's in Belfair? No, they have one in Belfair, yeah. It's, it's, it's not coming up on the thing. Yeah. Oh, wait. How are you spelling it? Belfair, Washington? Yeah. It says... It's, it's giving us Seattle ones and Tacoma ones and stuff, but... Weird. Maybe yeah. it's not in Belfair proper. Or... It, it um... No, it's in Belfair, I think, yeah. Oh, wow, it's a mystery one. Mystery McDonald's, yeah. You can't yeah. find them. We'll have to find their number or bring it in next time. Yeah, we have to go there and get <laughs> number <laughs> and be like, hey, what's your phone number? We need to call you and ask you if you have pumpkin chicks. Yeah. <laughs> we're not going to ask you right now. We, we, we're going to ask you later. I guess we could call the local one. I try not to call we're the state because... Bremerton, Washington. Bremerton, I, I always think it's, that it's up from there. they're going to... um. They're gonna recognize my voice and give me yeah. bad food or like. Oh, Bremerton, you probably didn't go there. You haven't even been there. Someday you'll go there with you. I mean, you. I mean if, if it's close, I might go there, but I don't know why I would. What's, a, what's, a, what's in Bremerton? Or uh, shipyard. Shipyard out there. How about in uh, Belfair? Uh, Belfair is more like, um, well, Shelton's kind of like the logging town, and Shelton's the county seat of Mason County. And then Belfair is sort of like, um, it's like, uh, I think there's a brush picking shed out there and stuff. Yeah, there's like some people moving in with like summer homes every now and again too. And brush picking? Yeah, there's brush picking. Some people, What's some friends I knew, uh, picked up brush? a brush shed. Yeah, oh, there's brush? also, uh, what is brush picking? It's like you pick brush and, yeah, so you know, sell it? What? It's like, like bushes? <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> bush inside. What is I, bush? I don't. I, I I never really. I don't go to it. With it. Do you go to like to, uh, uh, to Walmart and buy some brush? I mean, you know, it's good. <laughs> brush is yeah. I'm not sure what brush. I think back in the day, there were people would joke about like you know like Shelton's the loggers and Belters the brush pickers, <laughs> and uh, oh, there was also like a Stretch Island fruit leather factory, like kind of s- a little bit south of. Um, Alan, where where I'm from, at least that. Yeah. Have you ever been there, the factory? Uh, not inside, but uh, I've been past it. Um, I uh, the woman who I say I don't know if she still owns the company or what, but the woman who owns the company, like I went to school with her kids. So. Did you, did you really gotta go in there and see the see the factory, like the machines and stuff? Yeah, I don't know. I've never really taken a, a tour. A friend of mine worked there though. I had a friend who worked there. Does it smell like fruit? Uh, I don't know. Not particularly. Maybe they washed. This has got a mist. Afterwards. <laughs> they had to bathe the fruit smell off them. What's the list? Yeah. It's a list of the songs that will be played on the December 2nd episode of Dance yeah, Over the Dance. Songs oh, like wow. That's going to be the like week. Just in case I want to. The week's uh, December 2nd. Yeah, December 2nd. Oh, no, this is the, this is the December show. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I thought we were saying the November show. And you're going to be doing I'm this? Right now. Do you have all, this, all the songs? Just the songs that I've so far assembled into the uh, set of dance music that will be played on December 2nd. Yeah. You know what i got a problem with this is? I don't have my glasses on. I can't read this shit. <laughs> the way you I have to go over there and get my glasses. The way you play this uh, copyrighted music on TV? No. No, they don't. No, <laughs> they Yeah, we don't do that. We, uh, yeah. We write our own. We just look and we say, like, we say, like, all right, 
Hunters and collectors. All right, I, I got a song about hunters and collectors. Yeah. Hunt, hunters hunting elk in the forest, <laughs> collecting their antlers. Their antler collectors. Hunters and collectors. So, Luke, you need are those reading glasses, or can you just not this too much of time? This is my reading glasses. I can see stuff that's far away. Yeah, he's the uh, he's the far sided one, and I'm the near sided one. See, now I can I always, gotta, I always gotta wear these, otherwise I can't. That's much better. You're blurry. Whoa. Blurry stuff. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, yep. Who wanna hear this? Alright. Here's the song. People are waiting for this. <laughs> Come on over and dance to these songs. We begin with Root Boy Slim and the Sex Change Band with a song called My Wig Fell Off. And then it's Polyrock with Romantic Me, and then Adam Freeland, We Want Your Soul, and Heaven 17 after that with Fascist Groove Thing, Christy McCall, or Kirsty McCall, Walking Down Madison, and then after that the Electric Six with Gay Bar, Gay Bar, Gay Bar, Gay Bar, <laughs> and then Christian Brewing doing Captain Future. And then Root Boy Slim and the Sex Change band again with Christmas at Kmart. And then Gloria Gaynor, I Will Survive. Yeah, as long as I know how to live or whatever, you know, however that song goes. Great uh, disco tune there. After that, Daler <laughs> Mendy with the Tunak Tunak song. Tunak Tunak, Tunak Tunak, da da da. Yep. Barry Manilow, people. Barry Manilow, Co Copacabana. That's by request. Chupacabra. <laughs> Chupacabra. <laughs> After that is Junkie XL with Stratosphere. After that is Keisha and Queen kind of mixed together doing Radio Tick Tock. This is the DJs from Mars bootleg remix. After that is Hunters and Collectors doing the uh, Talking to a Stranger dance mix. Oh, see, I thought the name of the band was the name of the song. Yeah, backwards. Yeah, really backwards for sure. Okay. After that is Orbital and Angelo Battle and Minty. Oh, yeah, the Twin Peaks guy. Yeah. Battle yeah. Battle uh, Battle and Minty. Doing uh, Beached. Mm, After yeah, that is uh, Crawl doing FinDance.com theme. After that is Spiritualized. I think I'm in love. The Chemical Brothers remix. And after that is Ed Rush and Optical doing Wormhole, the disc one version. After that is Foxy doing Out of My Head. Yeah, and the Foxy. final song is Make the Girl Dance, Baby, 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 the Designer Drugs Remix. Baby, Baby, Baby. Wow. You put a lot of time putting them together. The, the song yeah, I take, I take months doing that kind of thing. Yeah. <laughs> Sitting in there cursing with his computer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he hears that. He hears it right because these things go wrong. Things don't right work right. right. And, you, and you're making a mega mix for the mix together. Yeah. And they're, they're going to flow to go with the beats and stuff into each other. <laughs> Segway and... They're going to blend nicely, yeah. Go from one song to another with a nice, uh, that makes sense kind of feel. Most wow. of the time. Most of the time. Yeah. You, put those, you put your soundtracks out after, after you do the thing, or you just uh, only put them on the show, that's it? Only put them on the show, that's it. Oh, so yeah. you guys got to go to dance or they have to hear these uh, mix <laughs> there. Just watch the show. Tune in to TCTV. You can TV. buy them from TCTV. You can buy copies of the show. You can buy it from them? Well, uh, like you have to pay to yeah. copy the tapes or something. Pay, pay, the tape. pay for oh, the DVD. Yeah, yeah, copy copies. You guys can get copies of this show. It's all on YouTube, though. If you guys want physical copies, you have all the VHS tapes of the show. What's up, dude? They're all kind of lying around here somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> They're all over there. Oh, uh, yeah. All these VHS tapes. Oh, they're next to the heater, they're all melting. Can people buy like original VHS tapes of their collector's item or something? Yeah, like, sure, if like, you guys want them. Can like encase it in gold, plating or something? Yeah, I wanted to do a box set. Put a photo. A box set, yeah. and we're getting kind of... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how many, how, much, how many hours you can fit on DVD, but we're on uh, episode four. Like yeah. Four, so... It was like... I don't know what, I think 411 was when you guys were on, I think we might be on. Yeah, no, actually we, we were on an earlier one, it was before that, I think, it was like 406 or something, 405, episode or maybe 408, okay, something like that, I don't know. We can look at, yeah, I get confused. 
Episode 411. That was like one of the more recent ones that aired, right? 411 was, uh, let's see, on the... You see, because I think it was, it was like around 8, 7 or 8 or something like that, because like we, uh, when we were on, you were talking about the week before being the 400th episode at some point. Like the Halloween episode or uh, something. I think the 411 was October 3rd. Oh, really? Yeah, so... Yeah. Uh, I think so. Okay. This is what I'm, I'm, I'm trying to figure out how I guess, <laughs> but... I think it was October 3rd, and then, so, uh... Andy and Bruce, it says there. Yeah, I think it was, I think it was messed up, though. Oh. And we didn't, we didn't have the right guess, so now... Hmm. Now, uh, now the calendar's not going back in the wall. Oh dear. Get that pin to go back into that pin. Super <laughs> hard plaster wall is that here. Yeah. This uh, wall goes uh, right outside, so I don't know what the... <laughs> I need to get a nail. It's like three millimeters of plaster on top of some <laughs> cinder block <laughs> going on here. Look at this. This is really difficult. Oh, this is a it. problem. Let's call Home Depot and get a suggestion. Get a nail, yeah. So I think... We were last night 411 was on the third, so today is the where is it where are we today? Okay, the eleventh. Yeah. So eleventh, twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, sixteenth, seventeenth, eighteenth, nineteenth. Nineteenth. Oh, tomorrow Lewis's show is the four twenty show. Four twenty show. Two is four nineteen. Hmm. Hello. <laughs> Yippee. Yeah, we, so we get to be the 11 and 11. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's 11 and 11 and 11 and 420. Yeah, What's yeah. happening with that? Is there some kind of, uh, some kind of thing that's supposed to happen? There's, like, lots of ones. And then, in like, 11 o'clock, well, earlier today, I guess, like, 11, 11, and 11 seconds. So it'd be, like, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11. Who knows about, uh, that's the astrology or something? I don't know. Numerology. Numerology? <laughs> People who like numbers. Number uh, mysticism. Number one fetishists. <laughs> <laughs> People who like number yeah. one is so phallic, yeah. 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 It's called sure. somebody to find out what, what oh I think uh Sean is in the magic after Magic the Gathering. Oh, okay, Sean. He's in the like you uh like curses and uh yeah. to find out what, what, if this is going to Yeah, ask what Sean is doing today in honor of 11, 11, 11, 11. It's like veterans day too, so it's kind of a... Kind of, oh, oh, oh. Hey, Sean? Uh. Hey, hey, Sean, uh, you, you like, um, like numbers and magic and stuff, right? Oh, what? You like numbers and magic? You know about this 11, 11, 11 thing? Yeah. yeah. You know, is anything supposed to happen today? No, nothing that great. Eleven is the number of the cookbook, which is actually an evil number. It's a prime number, uh, so it cannot be divisible except for by itself. Um, it's, it's, an odd, it's, it's the number of chaos and unbalancedness, which, which would explain all the wind we got going on. Other, other than that, it's just a normal day, a regular day. Oh, uh, okay. You say it was a member of the Clipper? Yeah. You want to say hi? Hi! The China hi! Clipper. Talk to this person. Oh, Sean's a kid. Hi! Hi! Hello. Hey, you're on TV. What's your name? Keep talking to him. You ever been on TV? What's your name? I'm Kenny. Rick. Who's Kenny? Yeah. Hi! 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 Yes, what your name is. Why did you buy it? Hello! Do you like your What's your favorite kind of candy? Candy! 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 Did you, did you eat candy for Halloween? 
It's a day of the clipper. Clipping, clipping along. Alright. Alright. We have about 16 minutes left on the show today. We made it through almost three quarters of the show. What are we going to do? Look at that. That's 16. What are we going to do? We just left. Yeah, we have 16 minutes. We've got to figure out something to do. You know, sometimes I think that I should plan the show a little bit, you know, before we start the show. Topics, questions. Yeah. I don't ever do that, and then I get around to this time of the show, <laughs> and I just think, what am I going to do next? What's going to happen in the next 15 minutes? But, you know, when I, when I started the show, uh, you know, 400, uh, what, 19 hours ago, I, I was, one of the first things I said was, like, I don't know what I'm going to do. I haven't, like, it was in 30 seconds I was saying that, so. Yeah. But here I was, 419 hours into it. It took uh, a couple, couple weeks, I think. So, oh, oh we're going to call. Okay. Hello. Hello. Hello? <laughs> is it the, it's, it's the kids again. Did they just push the <laughs> <their laughs> dial? Hello? Dial back button on the phone. <laughs> Read uh. <dial. laughs> yeah, it's just the kids. They won't they won't they won't bend. Hello? Or kids? Or yeah, the kids just wanted to call back to school. <laughs> Squeal on there. Nice. It sounds like Cooper's Glen in the summertime. Speaking. Is that a uh, is that a crazy place? Oh. Yeah, Cooper's Glen in the summertime is all like squealing kids 
outside. The playground gets noisy. It's hard to sleep sometimes. Is that it, irritating? Uh, it's so irritating. Hey, darling. You can even have a fan going though too. So Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. You're on TV. How are you doing? Do you wear a diaper? I'm too old for a diaper. Well, actually, I'm wearing my middle ground, so I don't have to wear a diaper because if I have two, I'm going to wear a diaper again. Guys, I just see something to wear. I'm just saying, turn to you. Do you wear a diaper? <laughs> that's it. Are you that's a, that's a good <laughs> play back that joke for your friends. That's a good question. <laughs> <right. What are laughs> gonna... I'm really baffled by that joke. Yeah, I... <laughs> that's a really good mind trap. <laughs> I'm gonna go stump some people outside when I get out. When I walk out of this studio, I'm gonna ask people on the street, you know, Do you wear a diaper? <laughs> Do you wear a diaper? <laughs> oh, you can't, yeah, you can't get around that one. You go back first. Oh, that's right. <laughs> oh, there it goes. You wear back first, kid. <laughs> oh, man, yes. How embarrassing. Well, you, you guys can call, out, call the number here. It's 330 uh, you can ask uh, us if we wear diapers. You can do that. You can have a mess with us on the on the, the thing. But don't call us. Or don't call me. Don't call that phone number. Phone number's gonna come back up there. Don't call that number. Uh, something bad will happen if you can call. It, don't call it. So. Wait, yeah. Brooklyn number. <laughs> it's gonna come up here in a minute. Huh? The Ed O'Lim thing. Or yeah. What? Yeah. Don't don't call it. Why would happen to it? The phone is coming up. If you call, it'll it'll ruin everything. Oh. Don't call. Don't call. Uh, yeah, but don't call it. Do you have a problem? Keep it to yourself. <laughs> don't call us. That'll work. <laughs> it's real effective. <laughs> <laughs> That's the question, though, the problem is that people are supposed to call us and then we can help them with the problems, but nobody's calling us anyway, so don't call us, keep it to yourself. <laughs> Just bottle it up and explode one day. Yeah, yeah, whatever we said, just fly up until you die. Uh, oh, we have a question. Yeah. Uh, so, how do you take the bus down here, or do you drive? I drive. You drive? Okay. Ooh, I'm going to work. I'm a pizza delivery driver. Oh, wow. I'm a professional driver. Professional pizza. So I drive here. I did not have to work afterwards. Right. Mm -hmm. What do you do when you need to take a vacation? You do this every day. I haven't, I haven't taken a vacation it's been a, every year. You get, you never go out of the state? 1219 episodes. Yeah. Haven't left me in 24 hours. Oh, wow. Like you've got no family somewhere else to go visit for a month or no, something? No, my family's in town, yeah. yeah my family yeah, watches the show. Hi, Grandma. Yeah. <laughs> she often does watch the show, yeah. <laughs> well. Isn't that special? Yeah, so it's been four, I've been doing a show every, every single day, four and 19 days. Yeah. So that's, yeah, that's not that long. Compared to forever, that's what I always say. Compared to forever. Everything <laughs> pales compared to forever. Yeah. How long do you plan to do the show for? Uh, forever. Interview, interview Kenny time. Yeah. You can turn the show around on Kenny. The show will go forever. I don't, I'll, I'll probably, but we've got to watch the show. So it's going to be a 400 episodes so in the future. Uh, the kids are going to marathon the show from when they're born, but they're thinking that, you know, so when I'm uh, going to go older and stuff, they watch the show. Right yeah. now, the show's about, you know, like, like almost a week long, I think, 400, or was it 419 divided by 24, <laughs> what is that? It's like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, I think 16, 16 days about, about 17 days right now. Yeah. 17 straight days, is that right? <coughs> just lock everybody in a sensory deprivation chamber and want to make them watch the show. Yeah, you got to sit down and you marathon the show. So for you marathoners, you've been watching the show for 17 days. And you know, probably have a couple uh, couple weeks left. But you're doing a good job. <laughs> and I, I say hi. Keep it up. Don't go to the bathroom. Yeah. Don't worry. Don't be too long. Don't hit that pause button. Cheating. Anymore in the future. <laughs> in the, the future marathoners are just hooked up to tubes and wires and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm I'm watching. <laughs> yeah, you're watching the show. Uh, it's called uh, McDonald's. Uh, we've got Arby's. Arby's. It's called Arby's. How, how irregular. We're asking about. Roast beef. 
the roast beef, they're asking if the roast beef is a liquid. <laughs> so I, I heard... Is roast beef a liquid? <laughs> yeah, what's this? me out of my science project. <laughs> <laughs> definition of roast beef of our beef. What's the element? <laughs> yeah. On the elemental table of, of, of meats. I heard that your roast beef came in a You guys have to fry it up. Oh. That's what That's what we're gonna ask them to Calling the fire station or something. Yeah. This place is called Painted Post New York. Oh, this one thing we're gonna do too. Uh, Luke is gonna go and get a credit union, his first credit union account. Yeah. Are you gonna leave uh, are you yeah. gonna America, Bank of America now? He's gonna do it in Facebook. Yeah, yeah. Get out of there. Get out. He's gonna test it out first and then then dive off. Yeah, that I think it's good. I've been swimming around in the credit union. You could pool. Do that. Oh yeah. Are you happy with your happy with the credit union? Shoot. Oh uh, yeah. Are you happy with the credit union? I love the credit union. Yeah, I used to have KeyBank, and they sucked. Yep. And yeah, yeah, they collected lots of weird fees, and uh, were weird to me generally. Just like Hello, Jamie. Hey, McDonald's. I'm sorry. Is you McDonald's? I'm in Arby's, right? This is Arby's. Arby's. Do you guys have any seasonal products right now? Any what? Like Christmas stuff? For Thanksgiving? Um, no we don't. We don't have any uh, like eggnog or like pumpkin pie stuff? No, we don't sell that stuff. So, what kind of, what, what's your special right now? Um, right now we have two to five friends What? Right now we have the two to five French toast. French toast? French toast subs. French toast subs? Yeah. What's on that? Yes, we've got all right, thank you. Uh, hello? Hello? Oh, uh, yeah, so you rest these subs? I'm sorry, I don't understand what you're saying. Well, yeah, okay, that's good. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, thank you, hello. Oh, welcome. Yeah, you still there? Uh, and that's right on. Well, let's keep moving down the line. I guess he answered anything. No? Oh, there he goes. Uh, you have a you have a debit card and stuff with both the yeah <coughs> I was in Japan I used the bank from Japan and I was able to interface with it via the 7-Eleven on the corner it, it worked great yeah I mean I, I think that all the people who say that they stick with banks instead of credit unions because it's more convenient just don't really realize how convenient credit unions can be you can like pay your bills online with credit unions now and. A lot of the credit unions are like kind of like linked together now, so like any credit union ATM, like you don't get fees at. Yeah. So like the credit union, like the Washington State Credit Union, I have like a only credit union account, and the Washington State Credit Union ATM on campus doesn't charge me a fee. I can take money out from it. So that's right across from my radio show. I can do that. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to switch out of those banks. Yeah, I don't like those banks. Get out of Bank of America and stuff. stupid. <laughs> and then... Yeah, I got nothing over there. I have Bank of America. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, no, yeah. yeah I don't like them. I don't like them. They just they kind of impersonal and kind of act all shitty to you. <laughs> no, I like all the, the human beings I interface with at Bank of America. Yeah, but I mean, like, if you have a problem, problem with them, it seems like a lot of times they won't really bend the rules or they won't, like, make exceptions. They have their policies. Yeah. They... You know, we're not really well, I never have any of those kind of problems or something. Yeah, I don't know. I guess we, maybe I had bad luck because, like, I had... I forget the other bank I had, but I know Key Bank was one of the ones I had, and I, I just had horrible problems with them, you know, like weird, unexplained fees showing up and then them being kind of like... Wow. 
That's my answer to your fee problem. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was the answer. I just walked up. I was like, hey, I have this problem. This weird fee showed up in the room. They're like, no, 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 What? You <laughs> 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 yeah, have stuff in the <laughs> Eaten before I came in or something. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Are your bank. Deal with it. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, it's the idea of like local credit unions is nice to me too. I just Gives you really the, banks, the big banks, they're the ones that caused all the stupid problems that we're hearing about. We have, so we have about four minutes left in the show. You guys want to come back in what, four. Oh, December? Four minutes. Yeah, maybe. You guys can be the first December guest. The first December guest. Yeah, we don't have anybody scheduled for December yet. Yeah. We're in Lavoie, we're going to go to Lavoie on the 14th today. Really? A date with the voyeur. Do you guys? That sounds kinky. Uh, do you guys do uh, ha Hanukkah? Hanukkah? I don't do no <sighs> Hanukkah. Do you guys want to come to Hanukkah? Uh, I don't know Shanuka. where the holidays is a little bit like uh, yeah, earlier on in the, the month. It's like oh, okay. the 16th or the 16th? something. Yeah, sure. How about that? We'll follow the voyeur. Dawn. Are you there? I'll be over oh. in San Francisco. You wanna you wanna be on on oh, the side? Mm -hmm. If we skip a different time before you go to San Francisco, the well, the ninth is cool. I'll be around in there. Yeah, let's go to the ninth. Let's just bump it up more. All right. Um, yeah. <laughs> look at it. I was trying to lick my lips because they were feeling dry, and then I licked them. It's <laughs> one of those uh, lollipops. Oh, no. <laughs> at two o'clock. Oh, okay. Two. Two o'clock. Okay. Or three. We'll three? try to be awake by. Yeah. Three is better. <laughs> three is better. I like three. Why are you cramping on my sleeping style? Luke, yeah, you, you, you said you were just woken up yesterday when we called you. I just, right. I just woke up on, uh, yeah, like two. I woke uh, him up to get over here. Yeah, wow. Did you wake me up? Time to be yeah, up. I tried to. to oh, you tried to wake me up. I, no, I woke up on my own, though, but I, I think maybe it was like I, I subliminally heard you or something. Because I, I didn't... Very yeah, I had a little conversation with your subconscious while you were asleep. Yeah. And then I was like, me things. I'm, oh, I'm going to get up. Oh, oh, weird. It must have been like, yeah, I think I was still thought I was dreaming at that point. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then I suddenly kind of came to, I was like, oh, what? And I was like, oh, wait, what time is it? Oh, it's almost time to go to the show. Yeah. yeah. Wow. That's how we roll. Sleeping. <laughs> Are we dark? You guys live in a dark place? Uh, there's <laughs> trees, there's shade. It's pretty shade dark trees. out here all day today. It's been cloudy. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I can sleep. I, you know, I used to have a room where there was no curtains. Uh, on the room, and I, I would sleep during. I was a night auditor at a hotel. I'd sleep during the day, and I can I can sleep with the, the light streaming in. It doesn't bother me. No, oh, okay. Yeah, that's the way it is. Well, thanks thanks for coming on the show. Very thanks for watching the show. It's been a good hour here. Yeah. We we'll check the messages. We got things done, and uh, we did the show, and it happened again. Tune in tomorrow, it's the 420 episode with Lewis. And it's going to be a good time there. There's the countdown. For 420 tomorrow. Are you going to do a show at 420? Uh, no, yeah. maybe. Maybe, I don't know. It's Thanks, everybody. 420 at 420. You're welcome. 11 11, there was 11 no, seconds no, 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 I look like such a doofus on this show. Yeah. I like the vibrant Don't call. <laughs> <laughs> they stinking book. <laughs> Was filmed on the, <laughs> on the white rectangle. Thanks, crew. You guys all get a crew. Put that crew on there. Uh, enjoy the crew. Thanks, viewers. The, 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 the crew. There's a crew. I think they're all on the crew. They're on the crew. <laughs> Thanks, little baby. <laughs> Hell yeah, dog. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, dog. In Seattle. Yeah. Sponsors in Seattle. Bob bye. It's a big city. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. The old couch. Or the old house, or set it, set. Mm. 13, 12.